when a patient presents with testicular cancer, most commonly there will be a lump or a mass within the testicle. In some cases, if the mass is large, then it can be visibly seen or it can be seen within the scrotal area. Because it's a mass involving the testicle, it will just have the appearance of an enlarged testicle or enlarged side of the scrotum. Now, the most common uh, presentation will be a firm, rock-hard mass within the testicle. It may involve the entire testicle or it may involve just a small portion of the testicle and the presentation can vary. However, if there is a firm, rock-hard mass within the testicle, that, that testicle needs to be evaluated by a physician. Testicular cancers can have different appearances or different uh, presentations, but in general, almost every patient will have a mass within the testicle. So you're looking for an abnormality within the testicle, but more importantly, you're actually feeling the testicle to feel if there is an area of abnormality within the testicle itself. And these can all be indicators of the presence of cancer. Now, if, if there's an abnormality in, in something you feel and you're not sure what it is, it's always best to get checked out by your physician. Now, there can be conditions that affect the testicle that, that may not be cancerous. There may be benign conditions. You can have fluid around the testicle. You can have cysts that occur within the epididymis. And some patients are concerned that these may represent tumors. But in, in many cases, uh, we will reassure patients that these are benign conditions. However, if there's something arising from the testicle, if there's something firm, if there's a mass there, then it is cancer until proven otherwise.